Uh, good morning, everyone. And uh, uh, I'm happy to be with you today, our the uh, first Sunday talk. And uh, yeah, first we have the motivation prayer. Uh, we start right now. May universal great kindness and wisdom pond the way out of confusion. May the truth that brings ultimate peace inform my life. May the opportunity to gather with like-minded seekers lead to greater awareness. May the blessing of these teachings today be of great benefit to myself and others. Thank you so much, everyone. And uh, today's topic is the, uh, the, the great space, inner space. Uh, and uh, uh, how to uh, understand it about it, how to recognize uh, about it. And uh, uh, when we have this comprehensive understand experience, and then uh, we will get happiness uh, from inside, uh, from that uh, realization, and experience. So that is the point of the meditation of natural mind. And uh, uh, so uh, the, when we uh, have wonderful meditation experience, uh, we have the background of uh, the knowledge, what is it about the inner emptiness, about the inner luminosity, and uh, uh, so on. The quality of emptiness, uh, inner space, uh, has so many uh, numbers of the qualities. It can be extensively uh, explanations and many details. But in short time, we could not uh, explain many of them, but here, just uh, only conclusion of the quality of inner space. That is, I try to explain to you today. Hopefully, uh, this explanation very much help you. Uh, for your comprehensive understanding and experience of your meditation. So usually uh, the pure 
natural mind teaching is just mostly uh, introduction of the inner reality. Because everyone has inner Buddha or inner uh, enlightened quality is most important thing. If you understand that, if you uh, practice that, experience that, and that is the, uh, the most performed practice and, uh, and benefit and wonderful result. So, therefore, always the teaching introduced the, uh, the inner uh, quality and the inner Buddha, inner enlightened reality. In many scriptures, give example. The space, the space means ordinary space. The great master Timbanamka, he taught to the Joseph Homo, say, look at the sky. Then you will get the wonderful experience. He says that. Same as the example is important to guide to your direction. Otherwise, the ultimate nature is beyond of speech, beyond of mind. So, give example, the space, ordinary space. There's no diminution and developing. Everybody knows that the ordinary space is unchangeable quality. So same as the inner space, it is not ordinary space, but at some point is or uh, similarity with ordinary space. <clears throat> Inner space has no diminishing and development because it is immutable quality. When you uh, look at the space, sky, then you will get the feeling different. When you stay at home in the house, you will not get that experience. Therefore, people are hiking uh, mountain top and uh, location of the wonderful view, then you feel different, very special. Looks like it. A wide openness. Same time, your mind is open. You will get emptiness experience at that moment. So, so that is maybe just conventional 
phenomenon. More than that, when you take a law of inner space, it is big different, big benefit for your uh, this, the energy in your mind and your brain and your body and so many others. So, <clears throat> the another quality we have there, ordinary space also has the, no border and no center, because there's no direction in east and west and north and south. Same as the inner space, there is no border and center. It is infinitely wide. So I give example, uh, if you have the bake, from if you have so many stops and many people there, maybe thousands, thousand people, enough space. If you dancing, running, walking, whatever you do, it is comfortable in the space. Same as the inner space is infinitely wide. And no border and no center. Your appearances and your uh, relative phenomenon and daily based emotions, mind actions, energy actions, body actions, all of them end up space in the, your inner space. When you connect thing to the space, that is the, the best solution of the, your problems of the daily based emotions and negative energies. The quality is inner space. It is not a restriction, anything, any dimension of forms, mind, and other actions. So, all phenomenon uh, realities, relative uh, conditions, the universe, inner mind, outer, outer forms, whatever, everything. <clears throat> permitted by the inner space. We know the ordinary space also. There is uh, all universes, galaxies, planets, everyone is in the space. In our society or human being, 
the activities, positive activities or negative activities, whatever. <clears throat> Those are all uh, pirated by the inner space. <clears throat> Therefore, whatever you did, the, so uh, the negative actions, negative karmas, those are all could be dissolved into the space, go back into the space. Therefore, you could remove the old negative energies and negative karmas, whatever you did in this lifetime, in previous lifetime. <clears throat> so, that is also the quality of the inner space. Give example in the field, good field. If you're planting vegetables, flowers, whatever, everything, trees. So later, grow the result and harvest properly. <clears throat> Your mind actions, body actions, good thought, and helping others, like, like example, right? Kind to others or our humanity or sentient beings. And you eventually, definitely, you will be happy and you will uh, get good result because cause of effect. Or cause of effect is also the uh, the part of the quality of the inner space. Because finally connected to the inner space, everyone. Other things. The actions of the body and mind and speech, actions of elements, actions of the uh, emotions, actions of karmas, whatever. For example, we know the water, Water has so many different names, different language. If we call water, many million people don't know. Some people says pani, some people says chur, yeah, like that. So, but individually, these are actions properly working, functioning. The commissioner actions are functioning individually. So that is part of the quality of the inner space. If there is no inner space and it, these are not functioning, properly, no possible, thus individually functioning. We know in the in ordinary space, 
sometimes there are uh, snowstorms and rainstorms, yes, and hurricanes and bad weather, so many uh, bad things arising. Sometimes sunny day, there is a rainbow appeal. Wonderful colors, clouds. So, so many good things appear in the ordinary space. So, same as in the inner space. Today you are happy, excited, wonderful balance, but maybe tomorrow not. So ordinary people follow the temporarily phenomenon, temporarily uh, energies and Mm. and uh, uh, mind and thoughts. But why we do meditation? Why we need understanding the background of this meditation? Because we should be balanced every day and every moment. So, the ultimate nature, inner space, is beyond of cause and effect. It is a subknowing wisdom of space. It is not depend on uh, primary source. It's not depend on secondary source. Therefore, it is the uh, beyond of cause and effect. But other cause effect or functioning relative conditions are come from that. Automated nature, inner space is undistractable. If there's how much the powerful antidotes or energies, mind energy, the wisdom energy, whatever, They never destroy your ultimate in inner space. That is also quality of the, your inner space. We know there they are in the world many holy beings, many spiritual paths, spiritual traditions, religions, and traditions. Many of them, they know the miracle uh, beings, miracle energies. But we not know so many other things, many numbers, millions, billions, unkind about numbers. So those are manifestation of the inner space, the ultimate nature. We could say that is the space of wisdom. The wisdoms are functioning 
relatively, but the background or foundation is inner space. The other thing is transparent energy. We know that uh, you are human being, we are human being. Outer physical body, we have inner mind and energy and emotions. There are so many minds, consciousness in there. So, but the actually, if high level realization practitioner, according to their understand, there's nothing separate at all. When we walk on the beach, we see the waves, how much they are higher and uh, uh, dimension, uh, so the uh, dynamic moving uh, activities, but actually they are go back into water. These are part of the water and ocean. So during your meditation, you don't need to block your consciousness and mind and form, body, other activity. You could be uh, a meditation transparently because the inner space quality has the infinitely wide. The inner space quality has the transparently uh, the or say Balance, balanced, okay, yeah. So, whenever you understand the inner space properly, and then you be able to uh, meditate transparently of the nature of mind, or in a space. The other word said that uh, space of a single sphere, which means the relative mind and thoughts and cognitive minds, those are very difficult to understand deeply, perfectly, completely, because it is very subtle level. The singer, Sifil, singer means one thing, uh, the very subtle. The other things, there's no dimension of the form and direction. and uh, parts, only one universe. So, so that is not like form, not like earth. Yeah. It is, uh, the form of space, I mean, the, you could say the form, but sometimes philosophically uh, use the word form is just, is okay, but not real 
really form and uh, it is it is space not not any shapes there not any size there actually so so that is also the quality of the inner space people are thinking the inner space is just empty like empty cup right like empty bag empty house not that we use the word space sometimes says emptiness but not emptiness emptiness is maybe not a good word because this is say authentic condition and also spontaneous and partial space it is one thing no different there one thing so many qualities can be explained because authentic condition the vastness which is without prejudice a spontaneous presence the meaning right authentic condition and spontaneity the spontaneity also and partial space okay not partiality therefore all energies are spontaneity could be manifested whatever you experience the deities mantras and then mandalas holy beings or could be manifested from that nothing reject any activity but a speech mind because this is the basic nature energy so the other things the very important qualities are uh, say economity space space of economity so traditionally says la the alagi the space and awareness economy or without separation the space and awareness awareness means spatial awareness if you not understand without separation of the space and awareness and then your meditation is the ordinary gone uh could or would be ordinary meditation for example you, your mind is calm and uh, maybe there's no thought arising calm mind maybe a uh, you relax uh naturally good condition but it is not not enough your realization because there is a uh, two qualities important two qualities the space and awareness 
equanimity of the space and awareness. Otherwise, your meditation is looks like your body pressed down by mountains. So this meditation is not uh, only the mind calm. The most important, the reality of the uh, background for the, uh, the universe, who you are, condition, breathing, the ultimate nature and the appearance. Whatever you arise, daily base, emotions, thoughts, mind, agitation. What is what is uh, the the truly the reality of these relative uh, phenomena? If you not understand the uh, connection with the inner space and spatial awareness, and then you meditate the mandalas, deities, whatever those things, uh, I will say, uh, un, uh, unfinish, unfinishing, endless, yeah, endless practice. <clears throat> you cannot complete, completely uh, practice for that. <clears throat> because the root of foundation is not enough realization. Therefore, also the Sudra teaching said that <clears throat> important things. Uh, the form is emptiness, emptiness is form. Yeah, that time also they, they explain the basically, physically, because form Ordinary people thinking form is just form, not connected with emptiness, right? But if you investigate the body form, and then actually it is it's not exist, existence truly, it is the, actually emptiness. The emptiness is form. When you ever understand the emptiness, and then you know that all evidence are come from that, not separate. Looks like it. Clouds in the sky. Yeah. There is space, sky, and then there's place to arising clouds like that. So, particularly in the in this uh, teaching, nature of mind, pure those this teaching. Uh, the very important the inner space. <clears throat> that is how to play, how uh, the place to go, how to play, uh, uh, what do we say, uh, where to go the place. Yeah, where to go the place, where to liberate the place. That is the inner space. How to go to the place? 
So there are many methods. So this system is the path of liberation. The liberation we can explain so many ways, so many things. For example, primarily liberate. Intrinsic sub-liberation or intrinsic freedom. Or we could say natural freedom. Other things also directly liberate. Also another we said freed from extremes or liberate from extremes. There are extremes so many numbers. Uh, the philosophy ideas, this is this and that, so many directions, dimensions of the uh, extremes. But this is uh, free from all extremes. And other things also, we could say singularly liberated or freed. So those are how to uh, go to the place, how to uh, liberate into the inner space. So why? Say the liberation, same as your meditation. So that is, we could next time more explain about the liberation and meditation. Okay. I hope today that is enough for you. And uh, the next month, the first uh, teaching is uh, that time uh, we have event in Mexico City. And uh, maybe another day, if we possible, uh, make schedule and uh, we let you know. Uh, I mean, maybe through a web website. And if you uh, like, join the uh, Speed Jamo uh, Tour of Rain. Uh, that is, uh, we have the July 13 evening, 5 30, the California time. So, uh, or uh, Basically, we have the uh, events programs are showing uh, the website, Kunzunger, center.org. Okay. Thank you so much, everyone. We have the short uh, dedication prayer. <clears throat> okay. Through having heard and contemplated these teachings, <clears throat> may the path to peace become accessible. May the light of loving kindness and wisdom awaken and grow increasingly. Illuminated by truth, may I serve as a beacon for suffering beings. May the radiance of the nature mind dispel darkness and benefit all beings. Thank you, Tashi Dele, and see you soon. Bye-bye.